Hello everyone. Today, I want to remaster some of my liminal spaces from almost a year ago. A lot of these images have such interesting composition, but do not hold up in terms of fidelity. Let's start by taking this image. It's what looks to be a bathroom of some sort, but can you really tell? That's the beauty of this old AI model. Most of the structures it made are surreal. Now the fidelity is awful. It is 512 by 512 pixels. Let's fix that while keeping the same general composition of the image. Let's try this with another one. This image has an incredibly captivating composition in my opinion. Let's amp up the fidelity and see what it looks like. Denoise, activate. Now that is HD, folks since I still just absolutely love Mid-Journey Blend. What if we were to take these two images and combine them? Now we're cooking, folks. We got some serious liminal spaces on our hands. Okay, let's be real. Nobody's going to fit through that crack. You know what, now that I'm warmed up, let's do something we haven't done in a while. Viewer suggestions. This user wants to see a living room mixed with water liminal spaces. Should be simple enough, let's give it a shot. Some of these images are surreal. But I've also included this image that looks a little too normal. This was a good suggestion, let's keep going. This extremely dedicated viewer wants us to make liminal spaces using the city map from Gorilla Tag. I'm confident that this will lead to some interesting imagery. What we have here is a strange amalgamation of game graphics and real-life graphics. You ever just walk outside and think, dang, real life looks pretty good? If not, try it. Take a walk and look around. Do it for me. I'm a disembodied voice. I can't do it even if I wanted to. Next, I want to show you something interesting. I know I mainly used mid-journey. But DALI 3 was recently released through Bing Image Creator. And although Mid Journey is still better for liminal spaces, DALI 3 is pretty much better at everything else. One of the things it's very good at is Weird Core. I'll show you a few examples. Credit to Linkrum for the prompt that made these images possible. Can you believe this is AI, including the text? As time passes, I'm more and more impressed with AI. I mean, take a look at how bad DALI Mini was, and this was just about a year ago. Let me just rapid fire this list of suggestions from one of my viewers at you to show you the power of DALI 3 in a non-liminal context. Celery Dragon, Steampunk Caveman, Jelly Bean Tavern, Soap Cathedral, Dog Congress. And the list could go on. The only boundary is your imagination. Well, and I guess the fact that it's still not absolutely perfect, but that doesn't sound as epic. Anyways, let's do some more liminal space suggestions. This user wants me to combine the basilica cistern with the grass rooms. I'll be using the grass rooms that I generated back in the day. I don't exactly know where the flooded floor came from, but I'll take it. I love these types of liminal spaces. I think this is where mid-journey liminal spaces really shine. Liminal spaces that are very simple and contain a lot of harsh, dark or light areas. I'll show you a few examples of this from liminal spaces I made this morning. Sure, if your image idea is way too complicated, mid-journey will screw up all the small details. But for something very simple, it gets the job done. I've yet to see liminal spaces from stable diffusion or even from DAL E3 that can hold a candle to these. Okay, okay, that's enough creepy pasta for one video. All right, guys, I'm going to try and make creating these videos a regular endeavor again. Please leave me a bunch of suggestions so we have a lot of content to get to for the next video. It will help me a lot.
Also, if you want to support the channel, pick up some liminal drip from the merch store. Thanks for watching and have a good one.